Hello guys, today I'm going to be reviving my favorite celestial, Lassoon. It would take time as there's a breeding bonanza right now, and there's 500% more chances to breed ethereals. Hopefully that won't stop me from reviving him, let's just hope I don't get any ethereals. Alright guys, I got lucky, but unlucky at the same time, as you can see, I got a Rebra on Air Island, sadly, I don't have any more beds left on the castle to place him, and apparently, I also ran out of space on the hotel, so I can't store him there, you can see I got a lot of them, but I just don't want to sell any, for now I'm just going to leave him on the nursery until I finally take the decision to sell him, also, this is not the only ethereal I got, I also bred a geode, I actually can place it, but I didn't do it so I could do that sick transition, but, guess what, that's not the last ethereal I got. I also bred a humbug, this is the first one I have ever gotten on this account, and there's just 16 hours left, I might leave it here for a time, then I will teleport it to ethereal island, so I can finally get the poison element monsters and have the full ethereal island song, anyways, enough with the ethereals. I see you when I revive Blissoon, which was the point of this video. Well, here I am, I finally got done with Blissoon's inventory, I'm really excited to see what it looks like, and let's not forget that it's going to look like a baby, I really cannot wait to see that, here is the full inventory, now, let's go ahead and revive Blissoon. Oh my god, I absolutely love his design, I'm actually kinda disappointed for the sound, as I was expecting it to be longer, and because it simply sounds a bit weird to me, but the design completely saves it, it's amazing, I'm pretty much speechless, I seriously love that design, let's go ahead and read his bio, even though I barely understand what it says. The Blossom has emerged from its ancient shell like a flower blossoming in the early days of spring, feeling refreshed and vibrantly alive. A surprising development in the Celestial's renewal was the disappearance of one of its elegant Leoki legs. While countless botanists and horticulturalists of the plant element have researched this loss of limb, the biological explanation behind its late leg growth remains elusive. The Blossom appears undeterred however, happily hopping from place to place. This is probably the only description I'm ever going to actually understand. So, now I'm going to revive Hornicle, because it's the last instrumental in this, that I'm going to revive Tort and Glacier, because the percussionists are always the ones who completely change the song, as they also make it better, and I wanna have all of the other Celestials first, anyways, see you when I revive Hornicle.